guys, um, it's Stalpina Fall. So you haven't had a video in quite a while, I'm sorry about that. Um, I'm not entirely sure why I haven't done a video in ages, I just don't know. I mean, school's over, yay. Um, I've only got two years to go now, only. <laughs> um, I'm still currently doing work experience. Uh, I've done a week already, so I've only got to do one more week, and then I'm going on holiday to Sweden, which will be cool, because I'm doing loads of horse riding, and it's going to be awesome. Um, so, yeah, a lot of you guys were asking for sort of barn tours and studio tours and stuff, um, but obviously before, before I leave, I'm not going to have time to do everything. So, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to make a sort of votey thing, like you can choose whether you want a Schleichbahn tour or a... I think it was a Brea collection tour that some of you wanted, or like a desk slash studio ness tour. Um, so, if I can get my head around working out how people do those kind of like link things, like click this link to vote for this and stuff, um, then I'll do that. If not, um, just like vote in the comments or something. Um, so, I've been doing quite a lot of customizing recently, um, and I'm saying um a lot. <laughs> uh, so, this is. Um, 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 God, I really need to talk properly. Um, <laughs> this is a gypsy van custom, which I got from a trade. I didn't get it from a trade, I got the body from a trade. Um, and I sort of chopped its head off and stuck the Tennessee Walker head on it because I thought it looked cute and I'm going to make it into a sort of Welsh pony. I've already lowered this leg as well. Um, because it was like way too high so now I've got wonderful burntness here because I held it above the candle for a tad too long but that doesn't matter um, I also built up the top line and I completely re-sculpted the neck like I basically chopped his neck off sort of here and just completely put it back on so yeah he's cute then just today like a few hours ago <laughs> I did this I sort of um, straightened the head and uh, sort of sanded the ears off because they were really insanely rubbed so they won't even point anymore so I think I'm gonna put them sort of facing back so that she looks a bit grumpy and I also made her leg be like that I'm not sure what the technical term for that is um, but yeah she's cute then I am still doing the Shetland pony I've tucked her head her 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 head, um, and I made her a really cool new forelock. You can't see it, but it's really nice. I'm proud of it. <laughs> I'm so proud. <laughs> um, yeah, I did put a slot in it to make it tack friendly, but I'm not sure if I'm going to keep that. It's not finished, obviously. That's just the first sort of layer. And I used the rest of the milliput to put a sort of extension on her tail. I'm not sure if I'm going to cover the whole tail because it is a really old mold, so it's got loads of weird stuff on the tail, so I might do that. Um, other stuff, I made this. Uh, it's a sort of endurance set. Um, I'm really proud of the saddle pad, actually. God, I keep saying I'm proud of stuff. That's weird. Um, I really like the saddle pad. It has sort of extra padded inserts, and it's pretty cool. Uh, I might do a detailed video of this, and the bridle is sort of like a side pole thing. Sort of like reins and nose band. <laughs> it's kind of like a bozel but a bit more complex. Um, so yeah, and the saddle is pretty cool as well. For for first try and endurance saddle I'm really happy with it. So yeah that's cool. Um, uh, you've probably seen this guy before, you probably, I mean you've probably seen him, you know, during this video. Uh, I did him in art. He's pretty scary, yeah. Um, but he's quite cool, I'm pretty happy with how he turned out. This may seem a little random, but I don't know. Why not? <laughs> so, yeah, I did kind of do a lot of tidying. I'm looking at some reference pictures right now. Red done. Such a nice colour. Um, and so, yeah, I just wanted to say I'm still alive, I haven't died. Um, I really need to stop saying um. <laughs> Uh, so, yeah, I've got a new shelving thing, not sure why you might want to know that, but it does have loads of horse stuff in it, so I guess it is relevant. 
and um, yeah. Uh, if you guys ask for Schleichbahn tour, I'm gonna have to tidy my Schleichbahn. <laughs> so I'd rather you ask for a studio tour or a break collection tour. But I guess if you really want a Schleichbahn tour, I'll do one. Um, but yeah. I don't know what else to say, so I guess I'm just gonna stop the video here. Um, thanks for all you guys who, so, who are subscribing to me. I will try to make more regular videos, um, but now with me going on holiday to Sweden, I think it's gonna be quite hard for the next few weeks. Uh, but after that, I mean, once school starts again, that should be doable, I guess, to do a once a week video, because that seems to be what people like if you have regular videos and stuff. Uh, so I might do that. But thanks for like over 300 subscribers, I think, last time I checked. That's crazy guys I mean I never thought I would get this far when I first started um, and I've only been on YouTube for like just over a year I think so I'm really happy with that um, if you're watching this and you're new to my channel please subscribe I will love you and um, yeah my videos aren't usually this um, random I guess um, I just sort of sat down and started talking without no with bleh, with no plan of what I'm gonna do uh, but usually they are a bit more structured and I sort of talk about my customising and my tack making. Uh, so, yeah. Guess that's all I have to say. Bye!